Hello everyone, this is Mondan Raghavan and this video we are going to see Playwright with Java combination and in this video we are going to install the Java dependency for the Playwright in the Maven project. Before to that, we want to know why we choose the Java instead of choosing other languages such as like a Python and Node.js. There are a lot of other people existing in the market who are using Java and Selenium combination and we have the lot of frameworks as well. So if you want to reuse the existing functionality such as like a locators and utilities, we are going to use the Java along with Playwright. So with that, we will start installing the Playwright with the Java. Go to the official website of Playwright, playwright.dev. And here you can see the drop down where you can see the multiple languages such as Node.js, Python, Java and .NET. We are going to choose the Java. After choosing the Java, you will click on the docs and here you can see the getting started and you can just get into the installation. As part of Java Playwright combination, we are going to install the Maven project with palm.xml. So that means that in palm.xml, we are going to mention the dependency of the Playwright. Click on the palm.xml and you can see the have a look. Now open the Eclipse, go to the file, click on new, click project and click on Maven project. Next, click on simple project archetype. Next, playwright, Java automation. Let it be same for artifact ID. Click on finish. Expand the project and here you can see the palm.xml by default. Now go to the documentation. Here you can see the sample palm.xml, copy that. Just paste it here. And we will rename with the name, Playwright Java Automation. And remove the existing lines and save it. Once you save it, it will start downloading or it will start downloading your dependencies, something like a com microsoft.playrate and the artifact ID playwright. We are using the latest version as on today 1.25.0. If you don't see downloading the options or downloading the dependencies, go to the options on the project Maven. Click on update project. Again, click here. OK. It will start downloading. You know that playwright or uh, let's say any Maven project will be downloading the dependencies under the .m2 folder. Further, you will go to your C folder, go to users and under your username, go to the .m2 folder. For example, just open the repository, com and here you can see the Microsoft and here you can see the playwright. Once you download, you can see the same thing in the Maven dependencies here. And now go to the official documentation, click on the example.java. So in this video, our intention is just to install the dependency for the playwright under the Java. And we are going to use the sample file, even though without knowing the what it does. Just click here, go to the Eclipse. Under the SRC test Java, just click it, click create class. Let's say example, finish. Now just copy paste the same. Since we don't have any package created here, just remove this and save it. You know that Playwright requires the browser engines, but without knowing that one, we will just right click and try to run it. Java application. Just go to the console. Here you can see it is starting downloading the downloading Chromium and let's see in the same way it will download other browser engines. Just to see in detail, you can see it is downloading the Chromium for the first time, which means that it will download this browser engines for the first instance. After that, it will be using the same thing. And if you want to know where it has been downloaded, it will be downloading in your user folder, app data, local MS Playwright. It's downloading various browser engines such as like a Chromium, Playwright, 
Firefox and WebKit. Now, just to confirm this one, we will go to the same path. This is something different that it will not download as a dependency. It is the browser engines. It will be downloaded in your user folder app data local. Enter. Here you can see the multiple browser engines, Chromium, Firefox, Geeko and WebKit. Okay, now we will close this or minimize. Now again, right click and try to execute. Go to the console. Here you can see this is the title of the given page, fast and reliable end-to-end -end testing for modern web application playwright. If you go to the real page or let's say real one, you can see this is the same one getting started or let's say we will go to the page which is the home page dev. Here you can see the fast and reliable end-to-end -end test. The same thing has been printed in your output. However, we, we are not sure how it has been executed and what are the different objects we are creating here and what is the code does. We are not worried at this point of time. Why? Because our intention is just to install the playwright with Java. What are the steps we have followed in summary? We have created the Maven Java project and we went to the palm.xml. We went to the official documentation. We have chosen the language as the Java. Then we went to the getting started and installation part. Just click on the docs and you will see the getting started. Click on installation. You have used the palm.xml just to refer the dependency for the given playwright artifact. And you mentioned the Java compiler version like 1.8, both for source and target as per the palm.xml. In simple, we copied this palm.xml and kept it in our project. Then we copied the example.java and it is just opening the official website like playwright.dev and it is printing the title. When you execute first time, it requires multiple browser engines and it will download only one time. First instance, it will download and it will keep it in your MS Playwright folder, which is under the app data local under your user folder. So after doing this activity, it will not download every time. It is only one time activity, which will be done in the first instance. Then we are seeing the output in the console. Now we are good. That means that we have successfully installed or we have successfully created the Maven project with Playwright and we have tested a sample code just to make sure it works fine. Because of the sample code, we have downloaded the multiple browser engines under our user folder app data. So this is all about the introduction of installation of Playwright with Java. In coming videos, we will understand more on the Playwright with Java combination. So thanks all. Thanks for watching and have a great day.